you must implement structure in order to be aggressive. So you need to have structure in place in order to be aggressive. And this is a very simple way that I'm going to uh, lay it out for you. And you can also reverse engineer this for yourself. Consistency is a necessity to you being aggressive and winning in business. And structure is a necessity for you to be consistent. So if you must be consistent in order for you to win over the long term and structure is what's required to allow you to be consistent over the long term, then if we just reverse engineer structure is what we need to be focused on. And back to my first point, aggressively implementing structure. And first and foremost, it starts with your personal life. And secondly, we implement structure aggressively into your business. And here are a couple of benefits of structure. You guys might have already started to, started to think with this, but structure overrides your lack of discipline, right? We all have a lack of discipline in one department or another. For some of us, it may be in the fitness department. For some of us, it might be uh, in the business department. For some of us, it might be in relationships and personal life, whatever it might be. But we all lack discipline in one area or another, right? It's not perfect. We're always working. It's always a work in progress. Like I always say, one of my favorite mentors, Charlie Munger, he says, learning is a lifelong journey. So we're all imperfect in one way or another. And structure overrides the lack of discipline in those areas. Structure also overrides emotions. A very simplistic example to make sense of this concept. You wake up in the morning. Let's say you have a goal to be up at 5 a.m. every day. You wake up at 5 a.m. and let's say your first thing on the list on the agenda is to do a workout, to hit the gym, to get a workout and to get your body moving. Now, some days I can tell you from personal experience, my goal is always to wake up at 430. Some days I wake up and I'm feeling great. It's 100 percent. Some days I wake up and I'm standing there trying to justify to myself how to turn off my alarm and go back to bed. Right. Those are emotions. They fluctuate depending on many different factors, biological factors, mental things depending on where you are in, in the current situation with your life, with your business, it could be so many different factors, right? So your emotions will fluctuate. The, the hormones, the chemicals in your brain, all of that will fluctuate. So if you want to rely on that, good luck winning in your personal life and good luck winning in business because the greats at the highest levels don't rely on emotions. So how do you bypass emotion? How do you bypass lack of discipline in certain areas? By implementing structure. So question, which areas of your life do you need to add structure in. And right now we're talking about personal life. So again, we'll go into business later on in this month, but right now this is all about the internal. This is all about the personal. So question for you, what areas of your life do you need to slash want to add in structure? So take a minute to write that down. When things are chaotic, when things are messy, when things are all over the place, that's exactly the time you need to enforce some structure. So it can be easy to say, well, with my nature of business or with my line of work, it's harder to implement structure. It's a, it's a crazy day. And, you know, there are too many, you know, factors that are unpredictable, right? Whereas if you take a different approach to it and say, it is unpredictable, it is crazy, it is chaotic. Therefore, I need structure more than ever. That would be an opportunity for you as well. So you can take that problem and look at it as an opportunity. 